I guess we're back. Oh, I thought we weren't sure if we were going to keep doing it obnoxiously. Great. We've been practicing that for six months. Where yeah, have you been? Six months. Six. Yeah. We've been here literally every. This is the first time we've recorded in six months. We've been here. We've talked. We just haven't hit the record button. And that's going to be on me. Yeah. I'll yeah. take credit for that one. Yeah. That one's on me. That's fine. Welcome to the Rex and Around Show. How do we do this again? Greg, where do we even begin? I don't know where we ended. I don't think we knew we were going to end. No, we just were like... Mutually. We were just like, hey, you want to do something else this weekend? <laughs> hey, you want to go to Frankenstein's yeah, and wanna, buy toys? You, wanna just go, you just want to go... Yeah, you just want to hang out? Like, Let yeah, me... Sure. Issue a formal apology to you know. Absolutely there, no. Oh, I no, we were there were Con- some. Conor no, there were some people. There were some people who were like, "Where'd you go?" And I, we just didn't have an answer. Yeah, I think you know, Star Wars comes in waves, and 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 we lost a little bit of our momentum. There was a lot of like negativity that was just sort of affecting us. What else is new? You know what I mean? What else is new? So we kind of focused on ourselves. Yeah, uh, we we did I some, bought a house. Yeah, you bought a house. I. Oop. Uh, did not. You shouldn't have bought a house. Shouldn't have bought a house. No. Trying to return it. They yeah. said no returns. No return. There's okay. no receipt with those. 30 deposit? Uh, you didn't buy it from Target. You're supposed to buy it from Target next time. Home <sighs> Depot will build you a house and you Home can say, like, Depot. don't like this one. They give you a 30 day trial. Greg, you've been opening Pokemon cards now. That's Dude, new. Been, yeah. Streaming stuff's having fun. I'm there Same. every stream. Every stream. I missed Not a couple because of the move. Yeah, you're doing, you're busy. My gosh. I Dude. went to plug my vacuum into the wall the other yeah, day. Don't do that. Like, don't vacuum. <laughs> And the whole outlet fell into the wall. Oh, uh, just call your leasing office. Then, that uh, doesn't exist. Then, oh. we had them fix the flooring upstairs, and they yeah. knocked all the lights in the kitchen below out because the flooring smashed the lights. Well, you, I mean, that just means you need to upgrade your lights. Problem yeah, solved. Well, that's what's happening now. Uh, yeah, I just have an apartment. I just call the office if something breaks. Since? You should give it a shot. <laughs> since we recorded last. Uh-huh. Star Wars has shifted to the Bad Batch. With the Good Batch, if you ask me. It's a good, it's a good batch, batch, dude. Me. It's a whole good batch. If you look here, I have a Bad Batch box. What does that mean? It means that Disney said, Let's hey. Let's put Bad Batch on a box. And it looks great. You're valuable enough for us to send you a box. Cardboard. But don't think too highly of yourself. Yeah. Because we're going to knock you off that True. Yeah. high. Which is fair. Which they, which some is people, fair. Some people would pay to do that for to you. Yeah. You know what I mean? I am, uh, I'm just, dude, I, this is going to get, get, bear with us. Okay. Internet. No, oh, not you. I'm bearing with you. I listen, I, I'm, I'm doing this still multiple times a week. Just so, you, so it's almost like I need to get back into yeah. it because this feels very alien. <clears throat> yeah. I, I have a different energy. I don't know if everybody's noticed. I have a different energy about me. I like it. I took notes on the episode. So I've got well, some you things took notes to before. About. That's not different energy. That's the same energy. Right. It's just, will you get to those notes and actually discuss those notes? That's where we decide could open who it right Michael now. is nowadays. How, how do we get into this? Should we start by um, uh, opening the box? That feels right. Does it? The Bad Batch box. Okay. Bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad box. Wow. Get it, Be bad, careful. Bad One letter change and it's a bad time. <laughs> <laughs> you got some editing in it. Yeah. <laughs> My mask is there. I don't know why. Yeah. These, that? yeah. Yeah, these current wow. mic stands. Who set this podcast up? These current mic stands are not in favor or favor of moving. Right. So this They're is the Bad apart. Batch box, and this was sent to me by Disney for the May the Fourth premiere, and it arrived yesterday. Um, <laughs> so that's it, that's kind yesterday? of that's kind of where I'm like, uh, <laughs> it was May fifth yesterday. Yeah, cool. That's where uh, I'm like, listen. They like me, but yeah. they want to make sure I remember Not enough to one day ship exactly. it. Exactly. Yeah. They're like, hey, Just you know what? Uh, Know your place. I have no complaints over this. I'm so grateful to be included in this program. I'll hold the I'll hold the lid if you. Oh. Let me tell you that uh, I was on TikTok. A lot of people got this box. It's almost like if you didn't get this yeah. box, who? It's, what well, are you doing? I didn't get it. Yeah, I know. Well, I know. All right, so you open it, and there's uh, let guy. me cut, cut to me here. So this is what the box looks like. Got it. And I'm not sponsored. No, this is not sponsored. I will never take money from a brand. And you know what? I, I'm just gonna say never. You can clip it yeah. if I ever do. But uh, dude, it's just not worth it to take sponsorships or. You would sell out for Disney. Let's be real. <sighs> you know what? If Disney was like, "Hey, here's unlimited access to the park. 
Uh, do, I'll, I'll I'll do whatever they want. Yeah, I haven't been no, to Disneyland in over thing, a year. I still haven't been to Disneyland. If you're gonna sell for, for if you're gonna sell for Disney, it's gonna be worth it. Right. You're not selling out for you know a box. How's bro? <laughs> uh, what's in the box? <laughs> Oops. What's in the box? <laughs> Oopsies. <laughs> Oopsies. That's a new thing for you, buddy. For People, you buddies yeah. who aren't in this yeah. great stream, uh, my new bit is to say oopsies. Oopsies. And I like it. Yeah. And it's, it's catching. It's very uh, just annoying, but it's you're hot. hot. You're warm. It's not I that I'm setting up the set, dude. The set yeah. was in disarray. You got yourself worked There's up. There's another podcast who's using the set, and uh, you guys made a mess here. Yeah. You made a mess. Not the Kyber sisters. Yeah. They're sweet. We treasure them. <laughs> we well, treasure. also you set it. You set it up for them. So we, I do. We treasure uh, our Kessel Run friends too. But they're uh, they're just chaos. The treasuring's one way. They're another <laughs> level of chaos. It is one way. I guess they don't treasure me enough to clean oh, up the set. Man, there's five hundred dollar microphones on the ground behind Dude, us. This is a five dollar microphone. I walk in and there's just lint all over it. I'm like, what Kessel has happened? Run. Go leave Listen. a comment on the Kessel Run YouTube video KRT. saying to clean Get up it after yourself. Before you go MIA. All right, so <laughs> Bad Batch back. Disney wants me to know to watch the Bad Batch premiere. Watch the seventy May minute the premiere episode Tuesday, May fourth, exclusively on Disney Plus. But on Tuesday, on Wednesday, because you bum, got it late. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, and then this here's another nice. one from Verizon. Wow. That says uh, about the same thing. Do you have Verizon? I do. Do I get a dis do we get a like, discounts? Uh I think I have no. to pay more. Premier fan event presented by Verizon. That's it. It's little Greg, we don't complain. Look no, at this I'm mug. Like, okay. Look That's at that cool. mug. That's cool. You drink mugs? Uh I do. You have you ever is this mine now? Yeah. <sighs> yes. Dude. Happy birthday, Greg. Well, this is nothing bad batch related. Okay. They don't even say lo This love is it. bad batch related. Oh, love it. Oh, dude. You'll wear that. That's a f eh, I don't you know what? You're a dead hat Hold guy. On. Hold on. Okay. Let me take off my Ewok Hunt hat. Ooh. By the way, follow Ewok Hunt at Project Ewok Hunt. Yes. I think that's what it is. Yeah, <laughs> not Battlefront 2 Ewok Hunt. I'm a little bit... Because that, look at that hair. Wow. Hold on. Can you show the back, though? I love it. I All right. love it. It's Which it's is, not my usual style. Yeah. I can wear it up here. You, you'll, you'll figure it out and then put it on a shelf. I like the back, though. Just 99. Just like if you were oh, a sports. Look, I look like a cool you know sports I mean? guy. Wayne Gretzky in the house. Dude, let me tell you something. I was at the game last week. Barry Bonds clinched the no hitter. A hockey game? I said <laughs> Wayne Gretzky, and then you said, and then you said, I look like such a goober. Here, try yeah. it. No. If it's handsome on you, I just got a haircut. I did my hair today. Look dude. at this, you guys. Oh, I dropped the mug. I got to be better about switching here, camera ready? angles. Here, there it is. Oh, Which you look camera? like a oh. bad batch. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely genetically deformed. <laughs> <laughs> There's a funny joke. I'm gonna some, get to that. Some people are in there and be like, "Yeah, that's one thing for Greg." Okay, this yeah. is very cool. Socks you'll never wear. I love them. Shut up, Greg. I might. They Look should definitely gauge. Look at how good these I love those. socks are. This way, when your foot is sideways, people can see it says Bad Batch. Love wow, it. these are premier, you guys. I would say go buy them, but I don't think you can. Those are very nice. You know what I want to do for you, Greg? Yes. I don't know. But I give them to oh, you. Yes, I will wear these. You know why? Because you know, I I'm know... the only idiot in the room with a corp, dumb corporate job that has dress socks. That's why. I was going to say that. That's yeah. what I was going to say. Yeah. Check this out. This I will wear. I will wear the butts off this. It's not my well, size. And it's like so I'll I wear not. them all. That's actually pretty dope. It's really cool. Yeah. And it's tick. 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 I like how Omega Good says, idea, tick. Tick. Or is it good idea, tick? Um, I love it. Uh, destination oh. space and intergalactic date night mission. Ooh, uh, Greg, would you like to open this? <laughs> I think Greg and I should go on an inter should, intergalactic absolutely. date night. It wouldn't be the first time. They gave us, dude, Disney, you are too good. Popcorn, Popcorn, which you won't eat. Which, you know, they did this for the Mandalorian as well. They gave me, Popcorn. wow, that's probably so loud. All right, thank you. They Sorry, they did this for everybody. the Mandalorian as well. They gave me things. But I'll say the Bad Batch box feels more personally curated to the Bad Batch. Well, I mean, it's there's more it's theme. blue popcorn, right? But no, but with the <laughs> it's blue popcorn. But with the uh, with the Mandalorian one, it was there's it was balls like in here. Mm, no, you know what? I'll agree. I'll agree. Ooh, give me the ball. Well, there's multiples. Give me the Hold ball. Hold on. Hold on. I want to see what it says. Let me cut it. Oh, Greg. so this is like a whole thing. Okay. Show it to the class. Well, I don't know what it is. All right, I, don't show I, that to class. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't know what it is. It's like a game. Oh, it is. Comet oh, it crushers. is a game. Oh, it's a game. Yeah. Greetings, Earthlings. Created. I uh, look. Listen. Dude. That's so cool. Is and this so family thoughtful. friendly? Can we do it now? I'm just kidding. Play the whole game together. Look, there's little ball. space balls. Space balls. Michael, wait. No. No. Michael. 
It's a new oh. Michael. That was nice. New Michael. I just do boinks now. That was soft. I don't do slams. I do boinks. Call me Boink Michael. I will not. Okay. <laughs> I will definitely not calling Boink Michael. These are going to go on my company laptop. Yeah. Which they're like, Michael, you got to stop putting stickers on your company laptop. And I said, ooh, I'm sorry. At what point does it just become yours? Don't I own the company? Well, you can own it. This podcast has been brought to you by Super 73. <laughs> Do you need an electric bike? I'd like to sell you one. Yeah. My and then, dude, check already. this out. Oh, okay, this is cool. This is, I this... wanted this book. I almost bought this book. It's the Clone Worth Wars it. character encyclopedia. Join the battle. Dude, it's like that other big shipping company, which we won't name because we're not sponsored by them, probably get copyrighted, I don't know. But they send, like, the one thing you purchased and a huge box. A big, that's, that's right, worth right, it right, right there. Right, 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 right. That's wow. Cool. Does it have, is it updated with, with Bad Batch? Let me see, I'm looking. The beard bitch. It's I mean, it's mall. got the season seven mall, so. Okay. Let's see. Tick. Ricka. Echo. I think it's a great idea, Tick. Hunter. Terrible idea. Ob terrible voice. Oh, it, I mean, it, yeah, they're there. They're in there. Nice. They're in there. Because I'll tell you who it has. Oh, no. I'm I think I tell saw you who it them. has. Uh, let me, don't get me wrong. Great characters. Listen. Great characters. Wrong timing. Wrong timing. Um, I'm sure yeah. the bead bitch is in here. I it's can't got, find them there. I saw um, bo -Katan, Season 7 bo -Katan. Yeah, Season 7's in season here. Mandler. I just don't yeah, know if cool. the bead bitch is in here. Oh, they are. Look at that. They're, right Look at the they're, they're in there. They're, oh, they're, they're front cover. Right the bitch. That's all they get because spoilers. And then M&M's and Skittles. I think you're a Skittles guy. I'm an M&M's guy. Uh, absolutely. Yeah. Take your Skittles. Thank you. I love you. This. I appreciate you and I admire your. By. I admire your drive, your commitment to things. I I really am grateful for our friendship. Skittles. Uh, no, you, Greg. Oh. That's why I'm giving you my things. I gave oh. you half my Bad Batch things. And they were cool things, too. You gave me things you're not going to use, Right, bro. but they're cool. <laughs> they were cool. All right, let me keep the book. I'm keeping the box. Uh, <laughs> oh, Thank man. you so much, Disney, for sending yes. me that thing. Love it. Honestly, hugs and kisses to well, Disney because... No, 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 no. Just they do care. Oh, yeah. They're giving us what we want. Um, and I'm just so overjoyed. And you know what especially what especially makes me happy, Greg, is that the internet, for the most part, is done complaining about the sequels. Uh, I mean, for the most part, oh, they are. Yeah, no, they they're are. not. We've just muted well, them on Twitter. That's, we did that's do the this. Difference. We did do this. Yeah. Gosh, I have so many things over the last like six Dude, months. So that do you want to talk about the show about. first? Then we can just yes. we can just kind of go with whatever yes. we want to do. Yes, I think yes, it's a good yes, idea. Yes, yes. All right. Um, so the show aired on May fourth. You watched it on May the fifth because your box came in. Um, and that's cool. So back to no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I uh, I had major internet problems. The internet doesn't care about that. Have you no. guys been? Have you no been house. well? Let us know in the comments below if you've been well. We miss you. And and tell us what you want to see moving forward, because this format's going to change. Here's Is what it? I do need to Are discuss. We? Okay. I mean, format in the format of, like, I'm not going to be held to a podcast. No. Maybe one Why week I want to do a different video. And so I do want to stay state real quick. I have a couple videos I need to get to. Gosh, dude. Okay, so Hold one on. of- I want you to look at my arm. Look at my arm on camera. Buff. Look at no, bro. Look how pasty it is, guys. You want to know where I've been the last year? Inside. <laughs> and and contrary, Good Greg. Lord. Look at you. You're, it also seems like you're getting uh, lower in your chair. Uh, probably. I slouch a lot. Stop slouching. Bad bad posture. Bro. Um, Get better chairs. I'll tell you. I've been in the sun. I don't know if you can tell. Oh, I have new ink too. To look at how tattooed I am. I feel like that's. Look, I there. got this guy darkened. I got this guy darkened. So not, I mean, yes, new ink. Not new tattoos, just new ink. I look way cooler, <laughs> dude. I look way cooler. It's legitimately new. Tell ink. me I don't look cooler. You look cooler. Just just agree with them. Smile hey, kids, when you turn 18, and nod, get boys. tattoos. I'm tattoos kidding. Dope. Don't. Any more money for tattoos? I know. We got to get some more. Yeah. Yeah. Um. All right. We're Here you? we go. Let's do it. We open, and we're just going to kind of blow through our thoughts on this. Yes. I took some notes it, just to kind of give us a point of communication yeah. and talk. Oh, but also I was going to say, I, uh, I, I, I have some videos planned. I am going to do a Samoy Levart helmet review. Mm. We do love Samoy Levart helmets. I have three of his helmets. I want to do a full review on them. Educate people on purchasing yeah. helmets online. Yeah. I am also going to do a complete mm -hmm. guide, okay. an ultimate guide Ooh. to clone trooper helmets, 3d printed resin cast okay. fiberglass, how, how how do you make them? Boom. I'm going to have a table here. I'm going to have every clone. I have like 40 clone helmets. Yeah. I'm going to explain to people exactly you me, what you've got to do. You had me at until you said how to make them because that would require me to 
make them. I'm not going to, it's not a tutorial. Oh, it's just God. a walkthrough. Oh. Yeah, it's a guide. Oof. Oh, dude, I'm only doing the videos that are easy yeah, now, babe. Dude, yeah. I'm not taking any extra time. Yeah. You know why? I, I know I why. I don't know if you guys. You have a house. <laughs> <laughs> you you know, know, oh, they got a real pain. They probably want to know why. <laughs> it's not just because I have a house. Super 73 is exploding yeah. right now. And and it is well, taking we're inside. Up. This is dude, actually look pretty at terrifying. This. Look at this. We not shouldn't not be the here. bikes. The bikes aren't exploding. Okay. Whew. Look at my calendar today. Oh. I am like it's very every day is look, this was yesterday. This was the day before. This is a large part of why I haven't been posting on socials. When you're when you're when your company's popping, you gotta chase yeah. the momentum. No. Yeah. Because if if the company pops, it gives me and you a better yeah. chance of doing what we want to do in the future. Yes. So I'm chasing the momentum, everyone. If you want to help, you could support my baby little bike company. It's the sweetest little thing in the world. <laughs> Hashtag ad. <laughs> I said I'd never take money from a brand, but what if I'm the brand? <laughs> the brand. There you go, what dude. if I'm the brand? I can yeah. sponsor myself. I usually sell out. Super73.com. Yeah. Um, okay, so. Unless you have complaints, then. <laughs> Literally. Then, um, you know what's happening right now? Yes. Parker no, and Liam are dropping off a bike with Jojo Siwa. No idea who that is. She's this famous uh, uh, child performer. Not a. She's not a child. She performs for children. Okay. Um, I'm not 100% sure who she is, too. The bike cool. is dazzling. Cool. <laughs> the bike is dazzling. Okay. I don't know if they did studio photos of it, though. Ooh, I'll be so mad if they didn't. I love Michael always does. He's like, guys, we're Greg, I'm delivering this bike to this person. I'm like, who are they? And he's just like, it's this, this, this. I'm like, I'm so proud of you. And then he thinks I know what I'm talking about, and I know what he's talking about. 99% of the time, I have no idea who you're talking 99. about. Clone Force 99. Ah, Way to relevance. stay on brand. You're welcome. Uh, and a good segue. I do want to say that I think maybe they didn't Not do studio segue. photos of it now and right now. This is my brain right now. It's yeah. like in work mode still. And, yeah. and I'm going to be frustrated if they didn't take studio photos of it. But that's what happens when uh, Taylor quits. <laughs> that happened. Wow. That's just that talking. happened. Listen, I was trying to segue into the show, and you just segue right into that. I just that. wanted to tell everybody Taylor was like, not only. Let me get my what keys out of my pocket. What are you doing? I'm just disheveled, dude. <laughs> I what haven't are you done doing, this in bro? so long. I hope this is recorded. I don't even know anymore what's uh, happening. Yeah, Taylor Taylor quit Super 73 because uh, for good good reasons. We we yeah, parted on good terms. Like, please yeah, get yeah, to yeah. the details. Uh, he uh, his wife is is Do is right killing it on on socials. She's a roller skating instructor. Yeah. And over the pandemic, she started Zoom classes to teach people how to roller skate. And that girl is a boss. Talk about girl boss. Hashtag girl boss that's truly a girl boss she is just killing it and taylor's like dude i could jump in and help accelerate her and i was like bro you gotta go yeah so bye taylor <laughs> michael taylor? Literally, you gotta go and he kicked him out who's taylor who's taylor but i will say we we we're we're, 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 su we're suffering without him so we do we do miss him um from uh, from the uh, from the company, he didn't ever oh, add anything to like, the podcast. Like, he never. He I was like, just oh, like here. I didn't, I didn't realize I was suffering. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Taylor, I miss you. I love you. All right. All right. Okay. Let's get into it. Um, oh, batch. I also we have a. Um, I want to do a review on uh, Foxy Toy Box. He sent me the coolest sculpture. What is that, dude? I have this. I need just need you to know Foxy Toy Box if you're watching. Uh, Foxy Toy Box sent me a sculpture of season seven, the yeah. final scene. I want to make sure I get Foxy Toy Box right. I just want to yeah. make sure that is. It might be Fox Toy Box. It might be. I mean, yeah. You, I would say it's one of those ones where you put in, you Google the wrong thing and it's going to go wrong oh, way. Oh, gosh. Hang on one second. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You know, guys, bear Remember with when, me. Yeah. You took notes and you took the wrong notes. Uh, Fox Toy Box. There we go. Fox, Fox Toy Box. Do not add that Y. Dude, may not lead it is right one of way. the Website. coolest pieces and it's just, it's packed away because I moved. Yeah. But I want to do a whole thing with. Because cool. I just am so grateful to these creators who sent us stuff. You want to talk about the show? And if you sent us mail, <laughs> we're going to get to it. All right. <laughs> Remember we used to talk about the TV shows that, that launched? I mean, did we ever really? Sure. Well, I, I want to get to the two minutes of the show. Yeah, and then no. we'll go back right, to right. Where are we at right now? We are, uh, a, we're, we we're are in 16 there. minutes in. We're in there. <laughs> we haven't talked about a thing that's productive to progressive to the show. Hey, did you like how they animated parts of episode three? I did. In the intro. They animated Obi-Wan and Anakin when they were on Grievous's control tower yeah. uh, in the ship. And then they animated Grievous uh, taking the escape pod. I've been loving those side by sides. Where was that this? Was from, that was in the intro. I, th I You know what? I missed it the first time too, Greg. I missed it the first time too. I didn't even catch it. It's in the intro of the Bad Batch. It's Ant 
It's animated. You know what? Obi Wan slicing the Magna Guard. Animated Anakin cutting the battle episode droids. One, the first off episode. Of, yes, the seventy minute I, premiere. I think. I think I just. You thought it was a recap. I thought of it was what just it, recap. Right. I don't think I. They processed. animated episode three. Frame I by saw frame. it, and I thought it was just. I thought it was just going to be like that fan. Uh, that fan content that's redoing. I'm going to tell you. Let me tell you something. Looks really good. Looks really good. Looks really good. Anyways. Let me tell you something. I forgot. Okay, <laughs> All right. Cool. So I think other people probably missed it. I too. loaded the first episode up and I'm like, wait a minute. Is this like a recap instead of the actual show? I thought it was it, it was because like you had the like the original voice guy come and introduce the show. I forgot his name. Uh, something Kane, isn't it? Something like that? Tom Kane. Tom Kane. He came into like war. Previously, yeah, war. <laughs> war has ravished the galaxy. Yeah, and I was just well, like, and I was doing me like, I was like, it's one of those ones like, is this just a bad batch recap? Like, it's just like getting right. you ready for the show, and then it goes in like, oh, I don't know this Jedi, so this is fine. I have too many things around me. Yeah, you you you're struggling. You're you're doing too much. Uh, I loved, and I knew it as soon as they said it. When I heard Caleb, I was like, that's a familiar name. So there's a point of, uh, of course there is, point of contention here uh, in the fandom, and it's under, I'm going to say it's understandable. You know what I'm going to say? Go ahead. You already know what I'm going to say, though. No. Follow me. Yeah, I'm following you. There were a lot of people who were very heavily attached to the comic where Caleb Doom, sure. Doom loses Depa Balaba, and it was a really well-written, mm -hmm. you lived in the moment. They retconned mm -hmm. this scene. They retconned those clones. They retconned even the way it happened. And there were a lot of people that were really heavily attached to that moment. And I don't blame them in the slightest. Okay. I don't blame them. I will say, not a big deal. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. But I will also say... I understand. It would have been nice if they had... Stuck to it. Stuck to it. And why? Because why change it? Because that mean... Does that mean that... Because that comic was canon. Yeah. And now it's not canon. Well, that's a, and that was a Disney era yeah. comic. And they did the same thing with the Ahsoka book. And that's where I'm kind of like, I does nothing matter. I thought about it, and I was just like, who cares? Ultimately, who cares? Right. But and, then you and think about don't. it, you're like, I was upset when they changed the Ahsoka book. You know what yeah. I mean? When they wreck on the Ahsoka yeah. book. So it's like I get it. You know, a little bit of it, it's understanding. It, it's like, hey, hey, Disney era Star Wars, we're happy to jettison legends out the airlock. Well, some of us, but are. right, but. If you're gonna start jettisoning your own, your own canon yeah. out the airlock, it's, it's, I just what does nothing is nothing sacred, and that's where I'm. What I'm, do we attach to? I'm getting a little confused. What do we attach? Because I loved. In their defense, I'm normally confused. That's true. Yeah, but now on top of your confusion, we're adding le like legitimate, legitimate confusion. normal people, confusion. and it's bad for people like you. My little brain can't do a little process on it. <laughs> my, little brain, my little brain can't really process it. Is, it is frustrating. And, and again, like I said, when they did the whole Rex and Ahsoka, uh, like kind of fake death. In yeah, where they the buried book, themselves. And I was like, I love that idea. Yeah. And I was like, can't wait to see that in the show. And then they did something completely different. I'm just like, what was the point then? Yeah. I, well, and that's what this is. And it's like, it could have literally been anybody else. Yeah. It and could it, have been a lot of clones that we would have liked, or it could have been a lot of Jedi we would have liked to see. And not only that, but it's just like, you, and you, uh, not animated, you uh, put these characters in this comic book with a certain color and a certain design. Why not just transfer that to the show? Yeah, why are These are green? brand new, brand new clones. Here's what I'll tell you. My thought, I thought about this. My thought was that those clones were red, and they made a point of really... Enforcing in episode one the shock troopers the course on guards and that yeah. when those guys got there something was going yeah. down it was, if yeah. those clones if Captain Gray had been red or Commander Gray I, I'm sorry I'm not people would have associated it would have been a little confusing so I understand that and that to me is another point to say just use another Jedi and yeah. use another clone detachment I would have loved to see so many other ones yeah there's so many possibilities they had a lot. anyways it's okay. Um, I like, people, but I like the inclusion. I like right. the inclusion. I like that they did that. I don't think we'll see. I liked hearing Freddie Prince Jr. A couple of people complained about his old voice. Why? Who cares? You know who complained about it? Little yeah, baby boys. I know. Little who baby cares? boys. And little, you know what? And you know what? Boys. Freddie Prince Jr. stood up for himself on Twitter and told him to basically go uh, do things and, to themselves. And you know what they said? And you know what they said? <laughs> they said after that, they said, oopsies. 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 Made a mistake. Yeah. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, fun. Fun fact. Um, the minute they meet Omega, mm -hmm. um, so obviously you have that that whole scene. Crosshair is, is getting a little shady. We all saw it coming. It's it's nothing. Big. They're very smart. Why couldn't they piece together 
that Crosshair was uh, programmed. I think Tech. I feel like kind he, of did. I feel like he kind of pieced it together, but he's like, it's getting antsy. Been why here wouldn't you time. say something? You know what I mean? Like, why wouldn't you be like, hey, Hunter, uh, I have this little hunch. Here's the signs. Yeah. You know what I mean? He just well, like, oh my. And Tech, I mean, Tech multiple times was like, I thought you guys realized that. Yeah. He's tech a is smart kind one. of like, yeah, but he's also like, I can't be telling you guys everything because I notice a lot yeah. more than you guys do. He's the smart one out of it. Tech is, oh, I love Tech. I've Hunter. I didn't care for him in uh the like the Bad Batch oh, arc. Well, that's fine. I, I didn't care for you when no, I was watching I, that arc either. Yeah, for sure. Uh I like him now. I like his because I didn't you don't didn't get the personality well in the Bad Batch arc. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because the focus really wasn't on them. You were kind of just right. being introduced to them. But now that they're like you get the personalities, you get to flesh out who they are. I love tech. You want to talk about Omega? I do. One beloved. Loved. Love that we love her. Amazing. Love that everyone loves Voice her. Voice acting, Michelle Ang. It's Amazing. Never heard of, of Michelle Ang before. And tick. I love Rika, good idea. I think it's good. Or I think it's a great idea. Tick. Tick. <laughs> Don't waste <Dude>. here. <laughs> <laughs> I love I love her. I want I more think, of her. Uh what I love most is that we finally got a good, a very good and solid way to pronounce Kaminoan. Oh, yeah. Kaminoan. Because, yeah, because I was like Kimino Kimino. I was because like, it's Kimino. But they're known as Kaminoans. I'm sure it's been said before. Sure. But now we have multiple examples instead of having to dive through. Spoilers for the Bad Batch episode okay. one because I have this theory. I want to discuss it. Is that? But if you haven't seen it, keep scrolling. So okay. this is. I'm pretty sure we're all about. Okay. You gotta get it closer. Yes, I'm gonna. Okay. So this is Shayla okay. underscore CT0407. They'll never see it, so. Maybe they will. No. Maybe they will. Okay. Spoilers for the Bad Batch episode one because I have this theory and I want to discuss it. But if you haven't seen it, keep scrolling. Okay, so I'm pretty sure we're all aware of Omega mimicking Hunter in the holding cell, uh, where he would lean over and do this and she would do the same kind of thing. And she kind of did that a couple of other times, which was cute as now hear me out. Omega's mutation is photographic reflexes, like Taskmaster from Marvel, where she can see someone do something and be able to do it herself perfectly. Like firing the blaster, she wasn't able to do it, until she saw the others do it and when they asked her about had she shot a blaster before she's like no this was my first time and then right the very end of the episode when she's watching tech you know pull the levers and press all the buttons to fly the havoc marauder why would they focus on her watching tech do that if she's not you know remembering it subconsciously and going to be able to do that in a future episode i'm pulling it now that is her mutation i love her ah! oh <laughs> she's cute as f though Let's be real. Yeah, she. It's, yeah, it's cute. Everything yeah. she does is just, and it, and that makes sense because she's mimicking everything yep. they're doing. Okay, so they Tech says Omega's origins are unknown. Yep. So we don't even know if she's a Django clone. Yeah. Um. Also, Omega is interesting because that's the last letter mm -hmm. uh, in the Greek alphabet, and Alpha is the first letter. And where have we heard Alpha before? Alpha was originally Rex. Yeah. Alpha was supposed to be originally Rex, the most OP clone. Yeah. Uh, and they changed it because they didn't want R2, Alpha, Ahsoka, and Anakin. Did you know that? Yeah. They changed no, to, yeah, okay. No, <laughs> Look good. at it's me mansplaining. Yeah, it's Relax, cool. yeah. Mike. Everybody knows that. You're um, acting like this is the first time, but that's fine. Yeah, we no, can I'm move sorry. on. Well, it's a podcast. I just like, where's yeah, the line? Yeah, I was like, where's explain the to them. Maybe they don't all know. Yeah, but I don't want to mansplain to them either. I appreciate them, and I love them, <laughs> and I'm grateful that they tune in. Listen, there's people that read right off Wikipedia. And yeah, so, you I know, know and they like have more followers than we do. Been, yeah, <laughs> mansplaining things have been mansplained already. Like, it's fine. Um, at one point, Echo says, we've got a problem, and Tex says, not really. We're more... more <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Echo says, we've got a problem. And Tech says, not really. We're more deviant than we are defective. Give me the cameras. Give me the cameras. You're very bad today. Really? You're very, yeah, you're very focused. Can you get, can you be better than me? Probably. Will the camera well, reach that far? If you ask every one of your uh, devoted followers, no, I'll never be better than you. But if you're asking me if I can do the cameras a little better. Greg, yes. you are more relevant than I am Bro, right you now. say that. Just because I'm more more online doesn't mean I'm more relevant. No, you are. People still uh, ask on Twitter, like, hey, I love the Rex and Around show. And then, like, I'm just dead to the world. Like, you're Michael. part of the Rex and Around show, dude. <laughs> I don't know. I, maybe, that. yeah, maybe it was a bad name. Maybe tell the podcast that, was yeah. a bad name. <laughs> tell that to everybody that yeah. sees Michael and around on the, everywhere. Greg, you, you're remember really those bad times? cameras. Look at me. You remember those one times? I know. Well, yeah, you, I just honestly wanted right. you to... Okay, hold on. I got to figure out these cameras again, though. This it's is, literally our faces uh, are... Yeah, I just see Taylor's helmet still, and just like, it should be just a tombstone, like rest oh, in peace, Taylor. Rip Taylor. Who's Taylor? Uh, I, uh... 
I was talking to um, I was talking to like the I was on stream and I was talking to the viewers. Why well, brag about yeah, it? Yeah, I know, right? I don't have viewers sometimes. Uh, and they were like, "You're in Disneyland, land, blah, blah blah." I was like, "Yeah." I was like, "I'm gonna see." I was like, "They're like people." Wait, don't Greg, hang on, you. hang on, hang on, hang on. You didn't say anything just then. You didn't say anything. No, 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 what did you say the viewers said? I was getting there. No, 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 but you said- I was getting there. What, what was the I first was thing they said? I was getting there! Don't yell at me. This is a new era. Oh. <laughs> this is new for you, bro. This is- this is. <laughs> you, I'm a sorry, runner, It's more of that I didn't hear what you said. Can you repeat yeah, what yeah, you said? I was, I was going to clarify. I was working it out in my head. This is what I do. You should see me on stream when I say sentences that make absolutely no sense, and I say, Okay, guys, I'm going to double back real quick and now make sense of what I just processed in my brain. And now I'm going to put it into words that make sense for you. I hope those give you... Greg, this is not your stream. This Bro. is a family-friendly <laughs> show. And, and you know why he's, like, offended? Because if you know anything about Michael's, like, just the way he eats, is that it's a real possibility. <laughs> no, it's not. I'm edit all that out. Don't put me out there like that. All right, what were you saying? Um, I was talking on stream, and I was like, I'm going back to Disneyland. And people were like, oh, are you going to see? Do you think anybody will notice you? And I'm just like, bro, we would go to, and I was straight up, I was like, we would go to Disneyland. We'd go to Galaxy's Edge with no masks, mind you. No masks on our face. And people were like, oh, Rex and around. And I'd be like, ha, ha. And then they'd ask me to take the picture. Yeah, that happened one time. Yeah. That happened three that hurt, times. That hurt me, dude. <laughs> that hurt me. I said, don't you want, this This is great. Get him in the photo. They took, they took the and, picture. And then Michael goes, well, this is Greg. And they're like, Oh, hey. How often did I try to be like, you, no, no, it Greg. wasn't you. Yeah, it, you definitely were like, this is Greg. And they're just like, yeah, Rexing around. No, Love your tattoos. Th right. <laughs> I have to tell you, that was because of TikTok, though. Like, my TikToks were popping. I let all of you catch up uh, to me in follower count. And your was popping. It was. That's a throwback. Dang. Anyways, yeah, all right. That was that, that, that was funny. And then they were like, oh, Greg, I'll take a picture with you. And you're like, you're all like. Uh, and then somebody sent me a picture that we had all taken three together. And they texted to me. And they... <laughs> They blocked you out. <laughs> Who did that? I'm, telling you. I'm not telling you. Look how offended he is. Wait, somebody <laughs> sent you a picture <laughs> that we of three at Disneyland. Yeah, we three took. What do you mean, like a photo that, like a <laughs> all, it was, then it was Carlos. Was so it was no, Carlos. No, you act like Carlos is in my streams, bro. <laughs> He's going through oh, all the- Oh, dude, it was one of your- Yeah, you, listen, you are- You have a better community than I do. It, you do. You have Discord, you have your streams, you're fostering a community. You have oh, your little freaking minions. You mad, bro? And you guys make jokes as if, like, you're not here. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You edited that photo. You're not here because I made a video on YouTube. Enjoy your community with Greg. I made a video on YouTube. Clown, he's call yourself so clowning around. Clown. <laughs> uh, he's so mad. Was it clowned to snug? <laughs> it was. <laughs> it was him. <laughs> we took a picture with him. He was a target. I just wanted to oh lie to you. Oh my gosh! <laughs> what a dude! Oh, uh, you almost said it. <laughs> 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 oh gosh, I'm crying, dude. Oh, oh, that was so funny. Oh, that was great. What do you have against me? I only people, ever people gave 100 percent felt pity for me in that moment. I was like, don't send me your pity photos. <laughs> I, but I got to tell you, like that was oh. it was because of TikTok and and yeah, no, I know. I and, just thought it was funny. Yeah, well, it was, it's so did clowned to so snug. Clown to snug. <laughs> I'm gonna slash his tires next time I see him at Target. <laughs> <laughs> I know where you live, dude. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Oh gosh! Oh, oh, oh! And when I said clowning around, I wasn't talking about cloning around. You're special, and I love you. Thank you. All right. Uh, Echo says we've got a problem. Tech says not really. We're more deviant than we are defective. As if like Echo was saying, oh, we, there's a problem. But tech, yeah. in, tech read it as no, we don't have problems. We're deviant. Yeah. We're not defective. Yeah. And I think that 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 humor, dude, the humor in the show is so good. Oh, it's good. And it's not. I love it. It's, not, it's kitty. not. It's not kitty humor, and that's it's why I'm quick. loving. It's People quick. are like, "Oh, is it going to be like a?" I was. I was worried it's going to be a kid show. Yeah. 
I was very, especially with bringing Omega in, she's a kid, and I was like, this is going to be, I was like, it could, it could go very well, it could go very bad, and it's it went been really well. very well. That, it's been, dude, props to the writing team. Yeah, and I was worried. I said, I was worried, and I was, people were like, oh, how hyped are you? I'm like, I'm not very hyped, because yeah. I want, I'm positively optimistic, right. but I want to see what the writing does. Yeah. And it's, so far, it's been good. So far, it's been good. There's some people who are saying Omega is force sensitive. What do you think about that? Careful, because if you say something, yeah, 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 yeah. You, they're gonna clip it um, and post it when you're it's wrong. It's just like I don't know. Imagine the galaxy being so small that everything needs to be force related. And don't get me wrong. Everybody, everything's connected. No, I agree with force, you, Greg. But it's just like I agree. Grow up. You know what I mean? Can you like, hear me eating these M and M's? Yeah. No, absolutely. I'll stop. It's like grow up. You know what I mean? Is she? What is? Oh, Omega's the next Skywalker. Relax, people. <laughs> Relax. You know Some what I mean? Some people were like. Is Omega Captain Phasma? Like, imagine being so narrow, like just just tunnel vision. Well, I'm not throwing shade. Imagine at just being like Star Wars. Imagine fans. just being like tunnel vision. No, well, I I will. Greg is as salty as ever. Everyone. People, pe people just sometimes just need the shade. Imagine just being so tunnel vision, where it's just like I don't think you need the shade. The scope is just so small for them that it's just that's all they see. Like Captain Phasma, relax. If it becomes Captain Phasma, be so pissed now hey, because this is on camera. Hey, Greg. <laughs> how do you feel about fan theories and leaks? There's a reason I don't show up for KRT's recordings. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, people are mad in the Discord. I, uh, I don't let people talk about leaks. Spoilers. Yeah. Well, there's a, there's a large community that, that does care about those things. I think you and I yeah. definitely care less. And I think a lot of our community doesn't so much care about that. But there are, like, obviously, you know, KRT does a great job of, yeah. of building a, a really cool community. And I will say there are a lot of uh, uh, mirrors to what yeah. our community is. Like, they have a really positive, like, well-built community as well. But it's so funny. They focus on a completely different part of Star yeah. Wars. Which is cool because I've been popping in on their stuff and I enjoy them and I they just, record here. And if anybody says, oh, you guys are on KRT set, oh, well, well I'll block you. <laughs> How are the set leaks going? Uh, they, they shared some more the other day. <laughs> it was cool. They they shared, uh, I think they shared Cassian's um, where Cassian was Trees. actually in there. No, they, they it was Cassian. Was this a real set leak? It was Cassian and Shore Troopers. Uh, it wasn't a tree. No, I roasted them pretty well for the trees. <laughs> I was like, bro, that's, we so, do love oh, that's my uncle's backyard, bro. Roast him a I was like, that's bit. my uncle's backyard. But I'll no, I mean, the I, there's, I respect the people that love leaks, and I respect, obviously, KRT, they do a great job what they do. Yeah. But it's not, and it's not, we're I just in a, we're in a feisty mood because they just destroyed the, the set. set. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they um, had eight people on the set the other day. I was like, bro. Yeah. I didn't even lot. know you could fit that many people in this well, room. We've done it before. We got in trouble before. I deleted all those videos. They don't yeah. exist. That's probably a good idea. Sowie. Bowie. All right. Uh, po uh, show. Yeah. Uh, Dark Trooper prototypes in the Kaminoan training cool. facility. Thought that was cool. I thought that was cool. I looked up. You see You see the the weird sunken in helmet. Yep. And I'm just like, I know exactly what that is. Really, really cool. No, exactly. That was what that neat. Is. It was neat. Little I, nod. Yeah, I gotta say, I saw a lot of 12 year olds uh, commenting on Tarkin's thighs. Do Do you guys did you did you not watch the original trilogy? Those are the pants. If That's you didn't know, how they go. Um, Everybody was like, Tarkin has thick thighs. Yeah. I'm like, what? That's history been around. Isn't, isn't really, these, these kids, these don't really pay attention in class. Uh, yeah, so history, um, Ameri you know, not even American history, <laughs> it's just world history is not very taught very well. Greg has attacked leak fans. <clears throat> He's attacked Come at me. kids who don't pay attention in history. The, the, but but let's be real, they're the same kids. <laughs> it's, it's the same, it's, it's, you're, you're holding multiple fingers, it's the same, it's the same group of people. Wow. The opinions wow. expressed on this show yeah, you're are not do not reflect. You attacked mine. a whole country, bro. You attacked a whole. You attacked multiple countries. You Noah, attacked Noah. Just said, "Hey, are y'all shooting today? Right now? Uh, yeah, tell, no, no. Tell them at uh, yeah one o'clock. One o'clock. <laughs> That's when they shoot. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, so <clears throat> uh, I think it's Tonway. Tonway says. Uh, there was five altered clones mm -hmm. that remain. Yes. And Tarkin bitty, thinks bitty that sneaky. they're talking about Echo, but mm -hmm. she's talking about Omega. Yes. And so Omega's one, Echo isn't. That's why Tarkin didn't consider, concern himself. Just a small little note, when they go to Sagarera's group uh, on that uh, mm -hmm. planet, John Favreau makes a little cameo. Oh. He's one of Saw's guys. This has one line. I was like, that's pretty cool. Naturally. 
Naturally. Natural. I feel like it's good. That's just a good little nod. Noah said, oh, dope, because he realized that there wasn't going to be a conflict. I got you guys. I'm not going to, why would I, would I schedule a podcast to be at the same time? It's like, no, I love them. Yeah. But they messed up my set. Yeah. I have a little We should mess it up more. <laughs> Make it harder for them. Yes. I would plug everything. No, I would never. Kidding. I would never. That's mean. <sighs> Fun little thing. Did you notice that that, uh, that, uh, uh, when Hunter punched the Coruscant guard, uh, his helmet cracked down. I the did top. not. Yeah, I did I'll, not. Sh- I'll show you a little video. I took real good notes. Hey, Rick! Oh my gosh! Look, you see a little crack on his. You helmet. didn't take a video. You. I didn't do it. It's from TikTok. Oh, that's from TikTok user Clone Wars memes. Perfect. Wow, great username. You're that's... doing your job. To the point, I like they, it. They have a market. I have, I have no, no, I have no problem finding. And then now. finally, I have one more TikTok I want oh to talk gosh. about. Hey, dude, I've been doing my research. What did you spend your night on TikTok? Boricua Wookie, B O R I C U A Wookie. Boricua, it's Puerto Rican. <clears throat> really? Yeah. Hey, teach me, educate me. What is that? Uh, it's just like saying. Can you say it again? It's well, I can't roll my R's, but it's Boricua. Borica. Bor- sure. Bor- I'm Bor- probably saying it completely wrong Boricua. too. Boricua. Puerto Rico. If you guys Puerto didn't know, Rico. I'm half Puerto Rican. It's just Puerto I got, Rico. I got my dad's side of. Well, thank you, because yeah. that's cool that I learned that just now. This, this is one of the most important Star Wars images to exist right now. This is one of the most powerful images we've had in Star Wars in a very long time. This right here is what I think we forget about too often in our fandom. This childlike innocence. This pure hopefulness and expectation for a great adventure that's to come. At a certain point in our lives, each of us felt this way about Star Wars. Each of us experienced this childlike awe. And sometimes we, myself included, can get so wrapped up in theories and arguments and debates that we lose sight of this. So on today, this May the 4th, I encourage you to find your inner Omega to reconnect with that inner child and may that child show you the way to have a profound encounter with Star Wars once more. Never forget, the Force will be with you, always. Dude, I've become such a soft Star Wars fan. Yeah, well, I mean, it's fine. I just am so... You remember how just... Just... Bitter? Always, yeah, always bitter we were. Yeah, I getting away from having to discuss every corner of Star Wars has made me so much more... So, has I'm I'm filled with childlike wonder, yeah. and that that picture which was on the screen was was, was I knew the exactly. stars in Omega's yeah. eyes. And, oh, I loved that. And it was just like endless opportunity, and that's the next twenty years of Disney. And people also, were complaining about great visuals. Yeah, that's, it was amazing. <clears throat> people were complaining about Marvel releasing better Star Wars or Marvel content the day before Star Wars, and and I and I agree, Star Wars really just didn't care uh, this time around. But I, I have a theory here. And it's it's we're in this rebuilding phase. They they closed out the stories. They're closing out the stories from the previous era. And in twenty years, we will experience the same feeling that the Marvel fans experienced at Endgame because that was like a thirteen year run yeah. to build that up. And and once Disney era Star Wars can get this stuff off the ground, Mandalorian being part of it, the Boba Fett series, the Andor series. <laughs> The Ahsoka series, uh, I mean, we are going to be experiencing a new era of Star Wars, not filled with this negativity and anger because they changed things and they didn't close the stories out the way we wanted, but we have new adventures, new people, and it's just going to be joyful. The yeah. Marvel community has its toxic corners, but it's joyful. And well, I mean, I think that's, and that's, we've talked about this before, where it's just like Marvel had this decades of comics to kind of feel out where they want to go and yeah. build something up. They built multiverses of content right. that people absolutely loved. Star Wars has never done that. They did it with uh, Legends, but that was, I mean, again, you could argue that at the end of the day, a lot of that was fan fiction. Um, you had just, they just kind of approved people of doing whatever they want. Sure. You had, you know, you essentially had multiverses of Star Wars, which nothing lined up. And that's why it became Legends, naturally. But now they're doing it with um, the High Republic. Right, right, right. They're building, they're building a knowledge base of information and when, what works and what doesn't work and what people show interest in. And they're going to run with that just like Marvel did over decades of comic books. They figured out what worked. Yeah, it's a, it's a slow burn. And yeah. I got to say, I'm not, 
I just, I, I'm not super interested in uh, High Republic. I give it a try. Not necessarily for me, but I will tell you. Book-wise. Right. That's what I was about to say. Yeah. It's going to make a transition. Once yeah. they understand what works, what people want to mm-hmm. see, the High Republic arth- authors are killing it. Yeah. They're doing a great job. And we will cover some High Republic stuff. But um, Show's coming. There's, it's, a, there's yeah. a High Republic show it's, coming. It's going to be some really good new content. Um, and, and I'm excited for that. Yeah. And it's going to be hard for people to complain because it's going to be compelling new stories yeah. that people don't have the ability to compare to other stories. Yeah, I think it's going to be great. I'm excited for it because, again, it's new content, it's uh, fresh content, and it's going to be, I think, well, more, much more defined than, uh, I would say, uh, the, Sky- the Skywalker saga was. The, yeah. saga, the Skywalker saga was all over the place. Do you think we're going to see the transition of clones into stormtroopers in this show? Oh, absolutely, yeah, me, me dude. Too. Do you think absolutely. we're going to see a phase three clone trooper armor, or are they going to jump right into stormtroopers? I feel like they would because they um, somebody pointed out, which I don't have the mind to see these things, that they used sounds, sound bits, mm-hmm. and uh, st- like stylizations Imperial. from, um, no, from oh. uh, The Force Awakens, not The Force Awakens, The Force Unleashed. Mm. And like those older games. That's really cool. I think cool. they're going to factor in these things. I There are uh, Imperial sounds. Yeah. There's a lot more oh, Imperial yeah. sounds I mean, you now. look at the, you look at when, you know, episode two, obviously jumping ahead a bit, when, when, Tech no, we can is, go there right now. When Hunter is in there looking for the data, uh, mm-hmm. what do you call them, the chain codes, mm-hmm. that whole setup is now like imperialized. Tech was in there, not Hunter. Was it Tech? Yeah. No. Echo. Oh, Echo. Sorry. Wow. Echo. 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 He was in there and everything was like the whole, and he, you looked and he looked around like, what you you noticed, he yeah. looked around like, what is He didn't this? recognize it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're getting there pretty fast. I'm excited. Um... Oh yeah, it's it's good stuff. Uh, episode two was really cool. We we kind of all knew it would be Cut Laquane. Um, they said J nineteen, which is the planet. I wasn't, be... and it's a throwback because oh. I wasn't aware it was J nineteen. I didn't. So look at my... I also didn't uh, go looking for it. That's right, the right. thing. A lot of people were looking for it. A lot of people were like, "Oh, we know J nineteen. I was just like, "I'm definitely of the group that wants to just find out," um, which is why I avoid leaks, avoid spoilers. Um, so, and, but as soon as, as soon as they landed and like, they started walking, I'm like, I know exactly who this is. You know right. what I mean? Like I knew exactly. And Which that is was, cool. And that and, was great to and see. And we hear that Rex had just passed through. Yes. So they're on the same scent. And I yep. like that Echo kind of perked up and he was like, Rex. And I was, it was odd to me. They didn't spend more time as if like, I would, I would have thought that they would have been like, oh, okay. So there's others. We should start finding them. They, they kind of just glossed over Rex. Well, I, I, I don't think that they want that to be the focus of this show. I think- that's probably Rex's task. It will be the focus. Well, sure, but I mean, like Rex they're is coming they're building the they're building up the. Uh, I hope it's not the Rex show. And don't worry, I know. I, love, I agree. I agree. Hunter is enough Rex. Yeah. In the show, dude. Hunter, you mean Daddy? Yeah. That's, no, that's he's Daddy a good, Hunter. He's a good bro. guy. But that's what I'm saying is Hunter has a lot of of similarities with Captain Rex. Yeah. And um and so I think it would be almost superfluous to have them both. Uh, yeah. They will be there. I mean, we oh, know Rex yeah. is in it. He's in the trailers. Um, I hope he's in a small arc, and then he goes on right. his own path where he finds, you know, he does his own thing. We which... also know that they go to Mandalore. It's oh, in the the, okay. the planet is in the trailer. So I believe you. I, yeah. I just, yes, I don't think that's a spoiler. I'm a lore guy. No, it's not. They showed it. Yeah. They're going to go to Mandalore, so we're going to start to see some of the old stories. We're going to see closure on that. That'll be cool. Um yeah, I mean this the second episode it was it was more of just establishing. Yeah. It was establishing their plight. It was establishing that relationship, know, what that they relationship. need to do. It was truly in episode 1, which is interesting because yeah. I think that episode 1 was like an action-packed adventure. It was a movie. It yeah. was I mean you look at you look at the way the Clone Wars started. The Clone Wars started with a, you know, hour long yep. movie. Yep. Hour hour and a half long movie and we're introduced <laughs> to Ahsoka, you know, we got introduced to Omega. It gave uh kind of the the they prefaced the what the story is going to be about, what the the Clone Wars animated show is going to be about, and that's exactly what the first episode set of Bad the stage. Did. Yeah, and I think this episode two was truly an episode one in that it's really just kind mm-hmm. of like it's breathing life into the universe. Yeah, it's breathing life into like these characters we're going to be knowing. It showed us a lot of character development on Omega, oh, yeah. even on Hunter trying to get rid of Omega. Yeah. Um, Not even know. trying to get rid of her; it was uh, what's best for her. Well, it that's definitely what showed saying. that he had I'm uh, to get rid of her for her own say, like, sake. Empathy? I mean, would yeah. that be the right word for it? Uh, yeah. He's eh. he wanted yeah. what's best for her, and he cared for it. And actually, you could tell it hurt him to send her away. Yeah. And then when she came back, he didn't even hesitate. Nope. Yeah, he was. Stoked. He was just like, "If this is what you want, okay. you're with us." Yeah. And that's what I was. I was. It was we delivered mm-hmm. in a weird way. I kind of wanted her to be like, "No, 
when he told her. Yep. And he's like, all right, kid. You know what I mean? Not just like a, my bad. And you know, yep. just like they went on. But it worked out great. My bad. Yeah. My bad. My bad. Ton Weezy here. Ton Weezy. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I like where they're going with it. I like what they're doing with Omega. I like what they're hinting at. And again, it, it everything adds up to her uh, genetic mutation or whatever genetic, whatever skill you want to talk yes. about. It is a mimic yes. type yes. Um, trait yes. where she is just copying everything because she, the way she hit Crosshair. Yeah. That was a, and that even Crosshair was like, what yep. the heck yep. is going on? That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. So I, I really liked Shayla's uh, interpretation of that mm -hmm. in that, um, it's not, I like that it's not force sensitive. It's photo, whatever. Yeah. It's the, the, where, where when visual she sees learner, it, she can, learner. she can do it. And that's cool. A better word for visual learner. But I think she literally, Sha uh, say sorry, it. Shayla said it. Um, yeah, they, they said so, uh, photo, yeah. whatever. We're, Photographic we're memory. some I don't silly know. boys. Whatever. Yeah. People are counting <sighs> us. Thanks for watching though. You know what I mean? We're some silly boys. Just some silly boys. I'm going to go home and play video games after this. Just some silly boys being silly boys talking about Star Wars. Aaron Ferguson just texted me and said, Okay, so the bike gifting paid off. I pushed and pushed and pushed, and today we did a sunrise shoot of the Super 73 and Will Smith riding through the streets of Dubai. You're going to love this one. Love it already. Really going heavy on the Super 73 stuff today, guys. Sorry about that. I've just been living in it. No idea who Aaron Ferguson is. Oh, he's his personal trainer. He's the guy who oh, put me on Celsius. Love Celsius. Celsius, yeah. Man. I know that guy. When you say his personal trainer, I know exactly what you're talking about. Um... Uh, Disneyland. Who are you going back, dude? Okay, you went to Disneyland. I went to Disneyland. Give us a quick rundown on on your thoughts. I was able to go with the cast member preview. Uh, thankful do we have? I We're have fifty a, minutes. My uh, wife has a friend, very good friend. That well, is. <laughs> yeah, I have a friend too. Uh, just on a, on another level. Well, you yeah, you have an employee. My wife is wow, friends with them. Wow, I think Closer of him as a friend Listen, who ended up working for Super you're, 73. You're not going Let me tell to you dinner something. with him Let me casually tell you something. on a Wednesday well, night. I'm not, I'm not being like, invited. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's not. <laughs> to be fair, though, neither am I. <laughs> it's definitely. And to be even more fair, I actually completely understand. Yeah. yeah, I, yeah. I'm just throwing shade the, for the yeah. sake of being bummed I didn't <laughs> get to go to Disneyland, but Michael's I would like, not. Michael's like, why, where was my invite? I'm like, bro, I was lucky. I was It invited. would not have. No, no, it wasn't even a thought. It would not have. It would have been. It all, honestly would have. I would have been like, Jeremy, really? Why are you inviting me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks. I but. love you, but like, are you doing this? For your I, job, I can't, can't give you promotion. <laughs> right, right. I don't even have the power to do that. <laughs> that is, that's um, how this works. Yeah, so uh, I, I get, I get it. So how was it? What well, rate uh, it? So the good thing about it is that the cast member preview is no different from the current park opening. Right. Uh, we were just able to go a little bit earlier. Um, I will say the perk of going to the cast member opening was what is that open? People well, are, people less know. kids because it's yeah. a bunch of employees taking yeah. their friends or like family members. Less kids. Oh, so enjoyable. Right. And the kids that were there were the kids you don't want to encounter right um but 15 percent capacity so you know me in 15 percent empty park it was beautiful loved it but you'll never like you'll you'll never experience that you will because you will pay to go but i mean like outside of right now i mean obviously nothing good is about the pandemic but the 15 percent capacity was something to experience i gotta say man i it's bittersweet just because Disneyland holds so many good memories, unmatchable memories, yeah. because of the freedom mm -hmm. and the joy and the carefree sort of, we could shed our responsibilities, our yeah. pressures, our anxiety, and just like for a brief moment. For me, it was to like live in Star Wars with yeah. my friends and. And not have to worry about other things. And and the fact that the last time I went to Disneyland, I got sick for two weeks and almost died. Um, <laughs> was, I mean, I'm what, laughing, a, what a precursor was, to 2020. Laughing, it was a terrible. Yeah, you it were. Was, it was COVID. It was like, I, I genuinely think I got COVID at that point. Yeah. I couldn't breathe. I couldn't stand up. I For two weeks, I was stuck in bed. And it was like. That's how I left Disneyland. Yeah. And now to go back and to be wearing a mask and to be I, worried, it, it to me. And here was my concern. I was I was the same way. I'm like, I'm not going back anytime soon. It's not, yeah. it's gonna it's gonna kill the magic. I had no issue. It was it was so spread out. It was so I, I mean, know, I know, but 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 it's but it's changed forever. Oh um, no, absolutely. It's I mean it's not the same experience. The you, passes are gone. 
They're coming back like, in the year. They said, yeah, in some form. And I will pay. I will pay whatever. But yeah. I, I just feel like they're really going to like set limits because annual pass holders were the oh, biggest yeah. problem with Disneyland. Oh yeah, it well, was a problem. It sounds like the, the from what I've read. I'm sure there's somebody that has more information at this point. Uh, they're going to be doing the reservations. Remember they had the yeah. They so had that's the just pass. across the board. Yeah. Remember they had the pass. Where do you like, think I can pay one? like two or three thousand dollars to just not have to deal with that? <laughs> There's probably going to be a pass. That I can has sell zero things. Blackouts. I will sell things. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Not your body, though. Please, please don't go that I can't. Low. Nobody would pay for that. You heard it here first. I know that about myself. I'm in a weird physical state as well. Yeah. Just M and M's. M and M's at eleven sixteen. Yeah. And the result. Of no, that, it's I... fine. No, it's <laughs> fine. That's fine. I'm just. Oh. I feel. I will say the park was the park was a good experience. Um other than I will say the most inconvenient thing, which thankfully the most inconvenient thing was, was just this was mobile ordering food mm. because you couldn't just walk up to somewhere and grab food. Right. You had to, right. uh, if you walked up to a normal place that you could usually, well, I went to get a Ronto wrap and you can't just walk up Ronto wrap, please. And walk away. They're like, did you place your mobile order? And I'm like, yeah, no, it's a headache. Yeah, and that was, guess what, 20 minutes of waiting for my mobile order to get processed. Um, I want to say that's the most inconvenient part of it. That was the most, I mean, I was able to get churros, you know, churros and like right. the, little, the little thing carts are right. still fine. But if you want food, food, like some of the actual uh, food, you get to mobile order. And that's probably the biggest issue. Um, yeah, I mean, other than that, I mean, the six, obviously you wait six feet, uh, social distancing is in place. The uh, Haunted Mansion was insane line. That was the, probably the longest line. Because they could it's an inside minutes. ride, so they couldn't have It's an inside anybody. ride, so the limiting capacity, you can't shove you know, everybody in like sardines into the elevator to go down. Uh, they're very limiting how many people you can go on at the time. What do you, and I don't want to get political here, mm-hmm. and it's crazy that it's even a political conversation when I say that, but what do you feel about um, you know, a vaccine passport for it? How do you, like, would, w- at some point, we're going to have to take our masks off. Yeah, I think it mean I think it's, it's like going to school these days. You can't go to school without your yeah. vac- vaccination records. Yeah, I, I personally, I, I don't, I don't mind showing proof of vaccine to yeah. go into a place like Disneyland. Wallet. Yeah, and that's where it's almost like I understand that that sort of starts to get on like personal rights and freedoms. But yeah. it's like, but at well, the same it's, time, well, but hang on, it's not essential to go to Disneyland, so it's not really yeah. in. You it's also not really in inhibiting your personal rights and freedoms because Disneyland's a private place. You also have to, if you want to go to other countries, sometimes you have to have a certain right. vaccine shot. Well, it's, yeah, it's gonna happen. When I was a kid, to go to school, I don't have kids or really right, right, know right. anymore. Right. I have my parents had to get me my shots. Yeah. If I want to have a pet. I have to get my pets shot. Like it just sure. I, I yeah. It starts to get a slippery slope, and this is obviously yeah. not a political podcast. Yeah. But I did want to yes. say, I personally, I don't mind yeah. the idea of being like, yeah, here's my annual pass and here's my vaccine passport. Yeah. I don't have to wear a mask. Yeah, I don't even. And you know what? This starts to get crazy because people are going to have all sorts of conspiracy theories. Yeah. I wouldn't even mind wearing a special bracelet that says like, hey, look, yeah, that's it. I'm in. I'm vaccinated. Yeah, that could be. I know people get freaked yeah, out about that stuff. Yeah, I'm definitely. just saying I personally don't care. Yeah, I get you. I get they, you. they can care. Yeah. I don't care. Yeah. I'm not part of the problem. No, I get you. I'm just I, I was live. already vaccinated by the time I went. <laughs> Bro, I'm just trying to get six Mickey Fun Wheels. I was vaccinated by the time I went. So and fun. a personal security guard following us around. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, you want to talk about six Mickey Fun Wheels? You also have to make reservations in advance for uh, Lamplight Lounge. <laughs> I have not planned anything also, for one the thing, last 29 years of my life. One thing they changed, which I was not stoked about, to order, I mean, anybody 21 and over, to order alcohol, you had to show proof that you have re- recently eaten. And that means if you ate somewhere else, you had to have a receipt. And if you wanted to order alcohol and you didn't want to order food at that booth, you had to order food or have that receipt. I could not order a drink because I didn't have a receipt for the churro I ordered on the other park. And I didn't want the food that was there. So I passed on that. And then I had a disappointing drink later where I actually wanted food. But that's something new. That was a different experience. We go to we go to California Metro for the drinks. Not everybody does. But I agree. That was new. Yeah. I was not a fan. Also, they're doing this whole new thing where you, uh, if you have a park hopper, you choose your park. You can't Hate do it. A, you can't park hop until 1 p.m. You don't hate it because, hate I mean, it. we're not going for drinks before 1 p.m. We usually don't go to the park before 1 p.m. <laughs> uh, sure. Yeah, you know what I mean? And so we went uh, We went to Disneyland, obviously, first, and then it started getting crowded. 
And we were like, what time? It's one o'clock because all the California Adventure people had hopped over. So we're like, let's go get, let's go get lunch and grab a drink. And we went over and California Adventure was empty. Love that. Yeah, it was nice. Wow. It was super nice. What did you buy on May the 4th? Uh, nothing. Okay. Nothing. Respect. I am waiting for, uh, weird. I'm waiting for hot. To, well, here's the thing. I eyed a lot and I RSVP'd for the there you Clone go. Wars. That's what I'm looking for. Anakin sideshow. Yeah. And am I 100% going to, uh, keep my Hot Toys Anakin now box because I want that Clone Wars animated style? Absolutely. Yeah. Will that resell? Yeah. Anakin Sideshow? Maybe. Maybe. Because so, I already paid for it. No we talked it. about this quite a while ago. Yeah. The Sideshow doing animated series. We, we've we been asking for it. Yeah. And here it is. Here it is. It's like somebody... It's like somebody knows more than they're talking about. All right. I got... Well, let me just say, mm -hmm. since podcasting last, mm -hmm. when did we stop podcasting? Dude, I don't December? know, bro. I don't December. Know. Was it? Yeah. I don't remember. Uh, wow. Mandalorian. Whatever the last Mandalorian Wasn't that was. December? Yeah, we did the season finale. Uh, we got a lot of hate for the uh, live reaction, and then we stopped very soon after. Hold on. Let me just pull it up. I want to tell you what I've ordered. Ooh. Oh, since. gosh, dude. Wouldn't that be funny? Should I do that real quick? I got a Demon Slayer sword That's from cool. Sideshow. It wasn't, it was, it was on the Sideshow website. It wasn't made by them. Uh, I definitely, it was, it was like $80 and it was plastic. All right. So, the last video we made was. Know, Michael watched anime, guys. Michael watched uh, My Hero Academia and is in. Infatuated with the show, Greg. And the you and I, you and I did make a video. Um, what was it about My Hero Academia? Two maybe months we ago. No, we, we made the the Darth Maul unboxing video. Oh sure. The last sure. time we podcasted, yeah, was uh, the last time we podcasted was 118 days ago. Why doesn't it just tell me the upload? Yeah, that's date? weird. So in the that's last weird YouTube what the heck, figure it out YouTube. Stop making us do it. Uh, it three is, months ago. So basically, math. January. Days. Yeah. January. Okay, so since January, I have ordered. Wow, a lot. Yeah, I got that Lando, uh, the Dark Trooper. I ordered a few more of the Five Hundred First Battalion. <laughs> a few more after that, Death Trooper. And here's Snake Eyes, Storm Shadow, Ooh, Luke Skywalker, uh, Boba Fett, the deluxe version. Ooh, the Mandalorian version. Mandalorian. Yeah, and the uh, the 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 two pack. They have a Boba Fett with the robes and then Boba Fett oh, in armor. It's a two pack. Okay. I got the Miles Morales 2020 suit. Got a uh, dope. Got a Commander Cody that on the down low. I am uh, turning into we, Captain Vaughn. Okay, we can't talk about that. Um, though. Bo, talk. Bo Katan, uh, Darth Vader, the uh, the Industrial Empire version. Wow. I got a Shore Trooper. Vader. I got the General Obi Wan Kenobi Mythos statue. I got mm. the Obi Wan Kenobi Sideshow statue. Mm. I got the Asajj Ventress Mythos. Um, I, I I I got um, uh, the Midori uh, Bakugo. I said it right. <sighs> yeah, you did say it right. I've been practicing. I'm just more of You're like, ready. That's a and huge... And Todoroki deluxe version statue. My Academia anime. I got the Jango Fett. I got the Ahsoka from uh, Mandalorian. I got Captain America. I got Captain America, the new you got a Captain Falcon America. and the Winter Soldier, Ooh, Captain America. Ooh, yes, I'm dude. excited with the big wings and yes, the suit. I'm so excited for that. Dope, uh, I got Janae the Harry Potter uh, oh, yes. Tri-Wizard Tournament version. We know exactly what that means. And then May the 4th, I got Echo. I uh, got the Stormtrooper Commander. I got uh, a Sokotano Rebel statue. Did you buy that? Yeah, I did. That's interesting. It's big. No, sure. I just, I'm not a huge fan of the uh, Rebels version of Ahsoka. Sure. And not, I and not I like it with Rebels. And obviously, I, like I just I and just I don't like, like the outfit as much. And I got the sideshow General Grievous that they just unveiled. I, That's a good one. Here's dude. the thing, it's dude, expensive because it's shipping soon. I wanted to buy it. Yeah, I was like easy pre-order, and then I realized it's shipping, it's shipping like, like July, month. yeah, July or August, and I'm just like, oh, eighty dollars payments. I'm like, hey guys, I also yeah. struggle with paying these things off. So for those that are calling me a toy elitist, well, let me tell you, that's going to sound like a lot of orders. I have been selling a ton of stuff lately because yeah. of the move. Yeah, that's right. And I'm selling even more. Yeah. So, <laughs> I mean, like all that stuff is paid for in the stuff I'm selling. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's like it sounds like a lot, but uh, I'm just kind of rotating my collection oh, through. Oh, well, it's a lot. Oh, it's, well, it sounds like a lot. It's not necessarily it's a lot. lot. It's kind of a lot, bro. It sounds it's like it could be a lot. Maybe it's a lot, but it's not really that much because I'm selling everything that I'm buying. So I'm just rotating through. <laughs> 
Also, it's a lot. We've been getting sent a ton of mail. Let's we ha- we're just gonna have to yeah. do a couple pieces yeah. every episode. Um, so I. You got to get back to work, and we have somebody else coming to destroy the set, yeah. so we yeah, can't spend another hour doing another destroy it. box opening. I do have to. All right, so I want to open up. We have two uh, oh, pieces oh, of mail oh. from uh, Sacred Something by Kara. Oh, gosh. Been a while, man. So it's been long. so long. Into a Larger World, the fanzine. So Wait. we have two here. It Wait, may I have be, one, too. It may be the same one. I have one, too. Yeah, I know. That's why I, I split them up. It says Rex and Around, doesn't it? Okay. Hey, Rex and Around pals. See, oh, multiples. You I hope you're all doing well. Enjoy the new zine. So much cool stuff is coming soon. Have a great month and see you next time. Kara. Gosh. How did you, how did you open if this? You guys aren't following um, Into a Larger World. Yo, this is uh, a very secure. I got it. Sacred Something by Kara. Kara with a K. All right, so check that out. Got a little Rex sticker, which is just so cute. That's oh, going on my laptop that, love I'm, this. that I put stickers on that they tell me not to. This is the Bad Batch edition. Look at how cool this is, Greg. Oh wow, dude! Wrecker is my is my favorite. I wonder if wow, these are some these cool. Are yeah. Oh, I totally forgot we're getting Fennec. Yeah, we're getting Fennec. Dude, there's Shand. so much more to this season. We got 16 episodes. This bro. is a great addition. Look at these pages. I'm excited to read through what all the of this. Force. You thought I was gonna say something? What bad. a cool thing, Greg. Cut it, it to yours. What did you get? It says what the force. Uh, this camera. Hi. Uh, so it says same same little letter. Little thank you. Uh-huh. It's a uh, Tuscan Raider. Uh huh. Look, look at the little guy. Well, it's not a little guy. He's a big guy. Uh, this one is transmission received. I think Celebrating we're in that Star one. Wars podcast. We're in that. I think we're at the very bottom, which oh. is it's okay. I mean, we hadn't podcasted in a minute. Yeah, that's fine. Are we on the back? I'm looking. Hold on. <laughs> yes. Hold on. We got an honorable mention. Hold on. <laughs> Dude, did you see all the? Yeah, I mean, we're not on the front page. <laughs> did um, Kyber sisters get get more um, screen time than we did? I'm, I'm looking. I don't even see us yet. Uh, what the Force is a podcast. That's a good name. That is a good I name. Like that name. We're gonna take that name. Uh, okay. Well, at least we're in front of Kyber sisters, so we got that going for <laughs> us. But we're definitely at the back, um, so we don't need to show this one off. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, it's highlighting all the. It's it's highlighting. Right. We don't mind being in the back. It's highlighting all the uh, the other podcasts. I'm a little disappointed in our community for not for not uh, nominating us for Star Wars Podcast of the Year. I was yeah. looking at all these other podcasts, and I was like. Uh, well, we didn't say anything about it, so it's not really their fault, but you yeah. guys, you shouldn't have we, been we, on it. You uh, should have nominated us. We were paying attention. We were it's kind okay. of busy. We've been a little okay. busy. I'm not going to be disappointed in you guys. Yeah. Uh, but did you forget we existed? Yes. Did we leave for a couple months I'm and you forgot for we them. existed? Yes. I forgot we, we I existed. I will say there's some people who didn't, and thank you to those who didn't forget we existed that were asking when we were going to come back and, and not getting the answers they wanted. <laughs> All right, so this is from at... Zach Atz Design. Z A K A T Z underscore design. Rexin. Hey, mate. First off, abs. Well, mate. Is that British? Or Dude, is that- that's, that's an Australian. Oh, that's Hang a little on. bit of both. A New Zealand. Of both. It's New Zealand. Hi, mate. First off, absolutely love the show. Been following for a long while to get our Star Wars content fixed. The whole community aspect really hits hard, and you've inspired us to get involved and contribute more actively to the communities we're part of. We've started a Patreon, Discord, and weekly Star Wars stream parties. We have you and other passionate Star Wars creators and fans to thank for it. In return, we'd like to share with you some of the products we've created for this wonderful community. We hope you like them. Keep up the amazing work you're doing great. Zek and Rue. R-U-I. Rue? Rui? Rui. 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 I don't know. Look at me for a confirmation. <laughs> <I have no idea>. <laughs> <laughs> oh my <gosh. laughs> All right. Uh, wow. Let me tell you. These are some of the dopest stickers. Are they shiny? Holographic. Ooh. The Pokemon collector and Greg yeah. loves that. Look at so this. So this is a GG10. These are beautiful designs. Y'all making these designs? Oh, the war isn't owner over. Join the rebellion. It's like propaganda stickers. I like that. Rangers of the New Republic. Wow. Beautiful. Wow, Greg. I can't see it. No idea what it is. This is O M G. O M G. Oh, that's a lot. <gasps> what is happening over there? Okay, I'm okay. gonna cut away. You go to yours. You read yours. I'm gonna open all of these because oh my goodness. So this is definitely for the Rex and Around podcast. Um, this is from Steve Dot Makes. We know Steve makes, right? 
definitely for the Rex Round podcast. Definitely for the group. This is um, for anybody not. Hey Greg, you've had your time in the. For anybody that does not, for anybody that does not remember, this is exactly what I'm referring to. You've been streaming. This is why people are. You've been streaming. Ask me to take the hold the camera. Hey man, weird. There's there's multiple here. This is the wildest pin set. This is also how long. I want you to listen to this. How long we've uh, since we podcasted. I had intended to get this to you around Christmas time, but life and dropping got blah, blah, blah. You know how it is. Maybe consider it a slightly delayed Valentine's Day gift. So that's, it was such a February. What yeah, month that, are we in? What year are we in? Was this February 2020? Because I don't remember anymore. We have not been podcasting. Uh, if it doesn't fit, I failed again, but because it's China. He says he got it from China, so it might be a little smaller. Um, I just need to lose some weight. Hope you guys are doing well. We asked all you debut episode of the Carver Sisters and the continuing success of your work at Super 73. Thanks, man. This I, podcast I'm, is brought to you by Super 73. I am really busting hey, my man, butt you here. You know, you have people like Clone to Snug you know, who hold on, you know what I love you, though? and I have people who like Steve Mace you, who support you me. You know what I love, though? I don't think this is for either of us. Oh. <laughs> it might says, be for me. It says, I promise I'm not just sending stuff to Janae to make you jealous. Oh. Yeah. Well, I, I Steve. Just, just message here. It's very Steve, pink. Dude, there's so much stuff in here. This may be just, you know what? This will fit me perfectly. Hang Thanks, on. Steve. Steve, this I'm is, wearing this. I this don't care what you say. You. Yeah, it's got. It's what got, size is it? It's got uh, female shaped shoulders. Stop it. I do too. I know, I know. That's what I'm saying. It fits you perfectly. <laughs> it fits me perfectly. Uh, it's a large, so it's for it's you. It's for me. I'm Jim, wearing it. It says, it says, it says USL, Asia XL. Dude, that's okay. Yeah. It's time to Steve. Have, thank you. I'm wearing this today. I'm no, literally going to put this, this on. This is for the Rex Round podcast. We're sharing it. We're both going to get in after this. the episode. Thanks, Steve. You got I'm it. so stoked to have this. Dude, my, you have to see my this stuff. So, this okay. is from. Back to you. Thank you, Steve. I appreciate you. Thank you, Steve. I appreciate so you. So, you guys. Uh, my company's doing very well. <laughs> Please take a picture with me, Steve. <laughs> it's on you. Oh, it's so your, Steve it's your has a protective. So, all right, there's a protective enamel, like. Well, don't protective coat on this. I no, it says to take it off. Um, it'll shine better, but that's the uh, Razor Crest. Oh, it's like okay. a little desk standy. Look at these pins. Oh, those are fancy. I'm just gonna have to cycle through them. There's so many. There's so Where many. Where are these from? Check this out. Do they make these? They made all of these. Oh my god! Oh, I um, love that. At Zach mm -hmm. at Designs. I'll I'll have that all up on the screen. I love that one. Can I see that one? I'm not going to take Dude, it. Dude, there's some other ones that are sick. That's Look at this. dope. Look at this. Look at this Beskar Mandalorian. Oh, It's like my mirror. Gosh. Dude. I'm in love with the... Greg, uh, check this out. Oh, get out! It's an actual... What? Didn't you know they made stuff like that? Zach I didn't know these does. pins were, were possible. Look at this Boba Fett sitting on the throne. The king has returned. Oh, my gosh, dude. And then check this out. Check this. This is insane. Check this out. What is... Oh, my. It's a whole set. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me see it. What is it? Look at the little BB-8 spin. What are the characters? Are they all relevant Sequel to each trilogies. other? It's just... Oh, okay. Sequel trilogy. Dude, this 501st pin. Let me get better lighting. Look at this. So it's like the... Uh, what is it? Iwo Jima? I yeah. Think. Um, like they're... The raising the of the flag. Yeah, the raising of the flag. But look at this. This is like an actual flag on the pin. It's pretty sick. That is insane. It's clones. Obviously, it's a Republic cog, but it's this is dope. There's a little, there's a little um, clone helmet up here in the dirt. This is so yeah, cool. I know. And then there's the Smorai, which is this little keychain. Oh, I love that. That's cool. Wow. What a special thing. I'm so sorry this sat for as long as it did. Um, a lot of stuff sat. We have a lot of things to get to, yeah. to get to, but this is insane. These pins are so awesome. We're so grateful. Um, Thank you so much, uh, Zach, and I hope I'm saying it right. Roo, 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 roo. I have no roo, idea. Roo, 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 roo. I have it just no sounds idea. like I'm, I'm. Sounds like an engine that's not turning. That's well, when I try to say it. Just roo insult them. Just roo, insult roo, them. Roo, Why don't you? Just, roo, roo. Roo. That's the. Oh yeah, that. Yeah, offended. that's the first time I've done that, them. dude. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. Sorry. Gosh, better not get into that habit. Uh, <laughs> Oh, oh Anyways, gosh. you guys, thank you so much. If you sent Here, us something, so if you sent us something, we are going to be getting to it over the next few weeks. Uh, may even, you know, do 16 some special. Sixteen weeks, exactly. Uh, this is a limited edition there's of sixteen-week podcast. Yeah, there's a whole box of them. Uh, and if you like what you saw here and you're not subscribed or following, please go ahead and subscribe. Uh, we do a weekly podcast. Greg does uh, three streams a week. You can Indeed. find that info in the description down below. Um, you. you can buy a bike in the description down below. You can. If you have not seen uh, Bad Batch and you uh, want to and you don't have the capability to watch it, we're actually doing a Discord watch party. <gasps> 
So that's really watching. cool. Give me yeah. info on that. Uh, tomorrow, well, when are we posting this? I'm going to get it up today. today? So, Probably Saturday, tonight. tomorrow. We're going to do it every Saturday. Every Saturday, because I'm home every Saturday. Love that. Uh, every Saturday, we're going to watch the newest episode, uh, obviously tomorrow, uh, May 8th. Love it. Uh, we're going to be watching it at 3 p.m. Pacific Love time, it. which is 6 p.m. Eastern and 10 p.m. GMT. Bless up, baby. Yeah. Join the Discord. Um, if you don't need to find it, it's in my 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 Instagram. It's down you below. To, you have to go to my... Uh, the problem okay. is you have to go to the Instagram because this link I post will expire. They always expire. I can give you the right one. I right, give me the right one. It's only Greg fans. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> um, yeah. You know, if, if you're interested in the Kyber Sisters, that's a. I mean, you all know you've been seeing yeah, it, and they've been here, and uh, and so uh, make sure to 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 watch their take on everything. They're they're going to be coming back. They took a short like one week break because of the move, so mm -hmm. um, they're coming back. And uh, yeah, I guess uh, until then, I, I think we'll see you next week. How do I do this again? Are we back? I don't know. We're back baby. for 16 weeks at least. What do I do here? Uh, do I hit the? Do I can I hit just th fade it out. I got it. Love that. Yeah, we're good. Look man. at us. Look at us. We did it. We're almost like we did it again. Bye, Greg.